We're Laura and Nicholas. Two years ago, we exchanged our nine-to-five jobs for a life on the road. We are currently traveling around in Europe and just spent an amazing time on the Greek islands of Paros, Milos, and Eos. And now it's time to show you the last part of our adventure in Greece, the famous island Santorini. We have arrived in Santorini and we checked into our first hotel. We are staying in three amazing hotels this week and this is the first one. It is called Cavitagu and I'm gonna show you around our suite. It is absolutely mind-blowing. Just witnessed our first Santorini sunset and it was so amazing. Okay guys, not sure if you can hear us, but we're having dinner now here at our hotel at Cabochego. We're gonna have a good night. Yeah, we're going to have a good night guys. But I don't know if you can hear us really good because it's very noisy. Well, if you're whispering Laura, then no need to <laughs> I need Maybe to talk if you talk like a bit. normal person, Okay, okay. And raise talk. your voice a little. Okay, sorry guys. But anywho, we're having dinner. <laughs> Mini taco time! Taco Tuesday! It's Saturday. So we got back from dinner and normally there's turn down service so we expected the bed to be made up after our little shoot for sunset. That didn't happen so now Nicholas is playing housekeeping. <laughs> Housekeeping! Okay, anywho, Nicholas is making... These pillows, oh, they feel so amazing. I'm so happy we'll finally have a good bed. <laughs> yeah, me too, actually. After like all the home stays that we did, this sounds really bad, but it feels really good to be like in a nice room and to have like a good bed. You know? And a good shower! Because honestly, guys, <laughs> We stayed like in the homestays. There was like not even a thing where you could put your shower head in, so you don't constantly had to like. Hey, support the local businesses. Hold it. That's yeah, but we support the local businesses, so that's really good. That's why we don't mind sleeping in homestays. We actually love it. Anyway, I'm going to get ready for bed now. See you tomorrow. Good morning. It is the next day. After our dinner yesterday evening, we just went straight to bed because we were so tired and we slept so good. This bed, ah, love it. We've been sleeping in such bad beds and homestays for the last few weeks. So to finally be able to sleep in a luxury hotel with a great bed, we really needed it. Laura's getting ready. We are waiting for breakfast to be delivered because with COVID, um, we prefer to have it in our room, so they will bring it at 8.30. And then we'll probably take a picture with the breakfast because we have to make five or 10 pictures for the hotel. That's why we stay here for free, by the way. And then we will find an ATV or a scooter and we will start exploring the island a bit. Santorini, here we come. Breakfast has arrived. And I think we ordered enough for the whole day. This looks so good. Okay, so after breakfast, we rented an ATV because I think that's the easiest way to get around on the island. And this is our baby. Yay! Isn't it cute? No, it's not cute. I like it. White with green stickers. Oh, it's, it's a little racing machine. Oh. But uh, in the meantime, we drove to Ia, which is Ia? probably the most... Yeah, Ia. Oh, yeah. No, no, you pronounce it Ia. Really? Yes, it's the Greek way, Greek way of pronouncing it. I have no idea. Let's go. First impression, very beautiful, very cute, but way too hot. So we might just go back to the hotel and do this another day or at another time because we are sweating our balls off. We just decided we'll wake up tomorrow morning at six and do it in the morning because this is not fun, especially with the face masks. We're already back in the room because it was just too hot and we are gonna jump in the pool right now. It is pool time! Yay. 
so we did not vlog a lot anymore this afternoon because I don't know, we just got so busy. We got back home, met up with some friends, and then we did some sunset shooting. Again. Yeah, so drank a bowl of champagne. <laughs> So we're having a late night dinner in like a very local restaurant here in how do you say it? Imero Vigli. Yeah. It's super close to the hotel. It's like a two minute drive. So yeah. We just we wanted decided a quick to come bite. In. Yeah, and it gets super good reviews, so we're going to try it out. Good morning you guys. It is the next day. After our little dinner yesterday evening, morning. we went straight to bed because we were so tired, but we slept so good. And then this morning, we already went shooting at the main pool before the crowds arrived. And now it is time for breakfast. Yeah, and we totally went over the top for breakfast. We went a little over the top, but to be completely transparent, this will also be lunch because it's already 10 a.m. and we'll probably spend most of the day here by the pool. So we ordered enough to get us through the whole day. We'll eat it all. No food waste with Let, Laura I mean, and Nicholas. Nuts and everything you can just keep them inside and snack through the, through the day. Enjoy, babe. Enjoy. You look good. We just decided that we will finally leave the room today. <laughs> we are going to watch the sunset in Ia. We've been so late. Well, we've not been lazy, but this place is just... So so <sighs> yeah, we've been working a lot, but we've been chilling as well. We've been working while laying down and eating copious amounts of food. I just want to stay in here. Can you please stay <laughs> What is wrong with you? I'm a happy oh, you're a happy one? Yes, big smile. I don't want to be. <laughs> I'm just giving you a kiss. <laughs> I was like, what is that? Okay, time to get ready. Good morning. We woke up for sunrise. Well, it's 5 a.m. Yeah, sunrise is like in 40 minutes. <laughs> yeah, so we just tried to wake up early because we have to make it to Ia. Um, so we're going to grab our ATV, go to Ia, and shoot there for sunrise. And I really do not like that. Laura has been complaining for the last half an hour. I don't want to get out of bed. I just want to cuddle with my little bear. Yeah. Like, in all honesty, guys, I do not like waking up for sunrise for a shoot it's something we really do not like we just do it because we have to especially here in santorini most places are so crowded that shooting at sunrise is the only possibility for us to get a shot without tons of other people in it or without having to wait in line to get your photo yeah <laughs> which is something we like even less than waking up for sunrise so sunrise shoot it is Okay, so it's 7.45 now and we managed to take two shots. Yeah, and for one shot we had to wait in line for like 20 minutes. There was a photography tour right in front of us. Yeah. There were 10 people who got two minutes each. And so yeah, we had to wait at 6.30 in the morning, okay. which was really weird. But and now we are trying to find a third spot to shoot. The light is getting a bit more difficult. Yeah. As you can see, lots of places have direct sunlight now, which isn't ideal. But we're gonna try and find a third yeah. spot and then we'll okay. go Which back to the hotel, grab some breakfast. Yeah, just we're going to find a spot. Watch out, oh my God. I told Laura when we passed here five minutes ago, watch out, because there is <laughs> dog poop or I don't know which animal this is everywhere. She almost stepped in it once and now she almost stepped in it again. It is our last few hours here at Cavo Tagu. We're going to miss it so much, guys. Such a great hotel. Yeah, absolutely. The rooms are incredible. <laughs> I do want to leave. But we are going to another very special place. We can't tell you much about it yet, Show but you you'll see. It's amazing, <laughs> I think. I've never been, but we looks heard it. Amazing. We heard it's amazing. We're gonna take one last swim and enjoy this beautiful view. We are having breakfast right here by the main pool. So in one hour, the other hotel we're going to will come and pick us up. So we have one hour to finish all of this. Mm -hmm. Laura says no problem. She can do it in 20 minutes. Bye. 
Okay, so Nicholas is driving behind us with the ATV. I'm taking like the shuttle from the hotel. Okay, so we just arrived at our new hotel and we are at the reception now waiting to check in. And this view, so insane. This is what dreams are made of. I was really sad to leave the previous hotel, but I'm very happy to be here as well. Yeah. Okay, so we just had the most lazy day ever. So now we just watched sunset from our... What is this even? Is this a pool? No, it's not. It's a pool. It's, it's a plunge jacuzzi. pool. It's a jacuzzi because it's freaking hot. It's like, you know the feeling when the bathtub is too hot and you can't even go in? That's what this is. So we just got back from dinner and we didn't vlog much today. But yeah, we had a nice little dinner in the local restaurant. And then I think we're going to brush our teeth now just... and then go to bed. Laura is exhausted. I'm exhausted. It's like the whole day is just not in my day. And that's probably the reason why we did not vlog a lot. So honestly, to be very honest, it's so hard to vlog our life when you're not feeling at your best. I just want to be honest with you guys. I just didn't have a good day. so. That's okay, babe. That's okay. Tomorrow is a new day and you'll feel better tomorrow because so. you'll get a great night's sleep in that nice little bed and I'm going to hug you. I, I am going to hug you so yeah. much. Good night guys. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good morning guys. We're back at it again shooting in the morning. And we decided to come to this spot right here with those beautiful flowers, the blue dome in the background. And we're gonna try and take a picture right here. The sun is quite harsh already, but uh, we'll try to make it happen either way. Okay, so it's time for breakfast now, guys. Good morning. Morning. So what's really cool about the breakfast here is that they give a different five course menu every single day. Yeah. They start with a smoothie, then a kind of yogurt, and then, you know, the usual eggs yeah. or avocado nice. toast or whatever. And if you don't like something, of course, you can just yeah, request can something it. else. For example, and... like I don't eat eggs, so I changed the omelette for like an avocado toast. And that's perfectly possible, so that's good. It is so different compared to Cavatagu though. We had so much food in Cavatagu and then here, you get like these super small portions it's maybe it's better that the portions are a bit smaller because we've been eating a lot of food the past few days and this is laura working really really hard <laughs> well, honestly i've been i've been answering all the ends and i've been answering all the without questions. a phone no, I, my phone is there i was just Oh my god, this is like the first minute and just like not on my phone I caught you. He caught me in joy life. Laura just had the most amazing idea and that is to hike to the Skaros Rock, that is the rock in front of our hotel, in the middle of the day when it's the hottest. So I don't know why. That's what we are going to do. I don't know why I was thinking that, but there is actually we found out that there's a church on the other side of the rock let's show you so on the other side of the rock there should be like a church with an amazing view and you could actually stand on it so we're going to try that because it makes a great photo and you know and it's only 35 degrees now and the sun is at its highest so yeah great idea i love it She's totally ready for the hike. Do not film me. <laughs> no. I think I'll see my outfit, guys. It's so not on point. I need a cute dress. I don't like the front of this dress, but I do like the back, which will be nice for like our photo, you know, of a dress. But it's the middle of the day, so I need a bucket hat. To protect you from the sun. Exactly. And the pad is really rough to walk. So I'm wearing my hiking shoes. I would rate this outfit a 2 out of 10. So I think we're halfway there. How are you feeling? Good. Just continue. That's, just That's our hotel right there. So we went down like this. And now it's up again. It's a miracle! We made it! To be honest, it wasn't that bad. What? How long did we hike? Like 
20 minutes. Yes. The return will definitely be longer because we went mostly downhill and I feel like the return will be mostly uphill. Does that make sense? Yes, that does make sense. Okay, so we're going to try and take a photo here. What do you think, babe? Yeah, I think so. You think it will be good? Yeah. Okay guys, so I think we got the shot. We'll include it right here so you guys can see it. So we're quite happy with the result, I think. We don't know yet. We don't know yet, we just still need to edit it and everything, but... Let us know in the comments if you think it's a nice picture and if you think it was worth the hike. <laughs> in the middle of the day. I think the first thing we're going to do when we get back is just like dip Swim. in the pool. Yeah, yes. definitely. But not in our pool, no, that because that one that's a hot pool. Okay, and now I need to be careful and stop vlogging because I'm such a clumsy person, otherwise I will fall. Bye! Okay, so I'm not sure if we vlogged a lot today, to be honest. I do not think so. We vlogged the high, that I know for sure. <laughs> yeah, but other than that, we did not vlog a lot. We just got some work done today. We shot some content for some brands we work for. Sorry, I'm out of breath because we're doing all these stairs. Santorini has so much stairs. Oh my god. So we watch the sunset from our room because that way it's not crowded and we can just enjoy. Sorry for all the noise, by the way. Now we're meeting up with friends. We've known them from Instagram. We call them Instagram friends. We call them Instagram friends. We've never seen them in real life. <laughs> never seen them. Yeah, but now we're finally meeting up. We already got to meet so many other Instagrammers on this trip. So we're meeting up with Jeremy Austin and Miss Angevilla. I think that's how you pronounce it. I think so. Sorry for not pronouncing it right. But they're like the drone king and queen. I'm not sure if we'll be vlogging because we don't want to put a camera in their face. I mean, it's just not nice. We might, but if we don't vlog anymore, guys, we will just see, see you in the morning. Good morning, guys. I am so tired. So yeah, yesterday was like, what was it, 1 a.m. or something? We definitely had fun with our new friends. Yeah, it was really nice meeting them. They're like the sweetest people ever. So we will link their YouTube down below so you can have a look. Oh, they're really, really good. So definitely check them out. Okay guys, so now we're going to Fira. So we're just on the quad now on our ATV. And yeah, it's the capital of Santorini. We're going to check it out. Now we're walking around a little bit in Fira. It has like a lot of shopping opportunities. It's not super beautiful actually, but we we'll just There like, are some beautiful places. Though. Yeah, 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 there are like some there beautiful are churches somewhere doing not very beautiful. Yeah, like it's more like very touristic, lots of shop. But yeah, we'll just like show it to you so you guys get an idea of this town as well. Okay, so now we found a little Mexican place here in Pira. So we were both hungry, so we decided to have like a little snack. We have quick. a big dinner tonight, so yeah. just having something small. Yeah, now. we just needed like a quick, easy, small snack. Okay, so we just had a little sunset shoot here at the hotel, and now it is time for dinner. We are eating at the hotel. The restaurant looks absolutely spectacular. The sunset was incredible yet again, Santorini style. Morning. Good morning. Breakfast, Breakfast time. time. Breakfast time. <laughs> so it's our last morning here at Gray's Hotel. So normally we don't drink in the morning, but we're in Santorini. And I mean, it's our last I'm day here. <laughs> There's nothing in it. <laughs> oh my god. So yeah, so we're just like enjoying our last moments here in this hotel. And then we only have two nights left. <sighs> so time to leave Grace and on to the next hotel. Fancy schmancy. Okay guys, so we just made it to our new hotel, which is Andronis Arcadia. We'll give you a little room tour later in this video. The staff here at Arcadia has been so oh, nice. Oh, they've been super friendly. Like, we feel so welcome, welcome here, like at home, yeah, definitely. Now, we are going to go to the four bedroom villa because we want to shoot some content there. Today, honestly, it's going to be like, just shooting photos for the hotel because every time we work with a hotel we love to create all our photos on the first day so shooting day it is Laura's already taking some snapshots little photographer girl so we've been running around a little bit we're now in Ia we're going to try and watch the sunset and, and, take, a sunset finish, right? and take a sunset photo
Good morning, you guys. We've already been awake for two hours. We went sunrise shooting oh, my God. and it was so fun. Yay. No, it was really not fun, guys. This bath is so hot. Is it? Is it not refreshing? No. Oh no, not again. <laughs> We're gonna have breakfast in like half an hour because I'm starving, but I wanted to take a swim first. And refresh. And refresh, but it is not refreshing. Okay, it's time for breakfast now. I had a little swim, Laura had a shower. We are so ready for lots of coffee and even more food. Yeah, I am some... starving. I guess this thing when you wake up super early in the morning, it just gets so hungry. Hungry? Hungry. Hangry. Hangry. Yes. Okay, so we've been working inside all day. Um, this room is such a mess right now. But it is our last day. So we have a flight tomorrow morning at 11.30, I think. And Laura came up with the amazing idea that she wants to take photos tomorrow morning on the other side of the island. So she <laughs> gave me the task to find an ATV for a couple hours, which I already have now. And then tomorrow we will wake up for sunrise on our last so day. Sorry. Okay, so the thing is, normally we were planning on waking up for sunrise anyway and shoot in Ia. But then one of our dear followers on Instagram sent us a message and said that we absolutely needed to visit this one town that we will show you tomorrow. It's absolutely not touristic at all. No one knows about it. Well almost no one knows about it it's like but really, it's incredibly beautiful yeah it's a hidden gem and you can take beautiful photos there so i was like okay are we going to do it next time or are we just going to do it tomorrow morning so I'm like why not right nicholas is like so not so happy about laura, it laura has me working on my last morning but, I mean, but she said she was going to give me a massage to make it I, up i did not say that I never said it's on that. The vlog, it's on the vlog, so you have to do it now. <laughs> oh my god. No, but it will be fun. <gasps> you are such a loser. <laughs> I wanted to take the vlog cam, but it's just not. I'm just too clumsy. I'm too clumsy for this. We are having dinner tonight at Le Capetus and there it is. The last course. Are you satisfied? <laughs> it's really good. I loved it so much. But now I need my little nap. It was so good, wasn't yeah, it? it was really Best good. fine dining dinner we had in Greece. Oh, definitely. Yeah. By far. I think this is even one of my favorite restaurants we ever ate at, like in the whole world. This means a lot. This is the place to come for a romantic dinner. Well, if you have a few dollars. Licabetus. Good morning, guys. It is the next day. So we're going to a town that we've never been before. We're going to show you around. We're going to take some pictures there. Uh, Laura is making coffee. She's in the bathroom right now, but coffee is being made right there. And then uh, we'll have breakfast here at the hotel, go to the airport and fly back home. So sad. Okay, so we made it to the little town and it is so beautiful. It's incredible. Just took our shot here and we are so happy with it. We will we will post it on the screen right here for you guys to see. Last breakfast in paradise. I'm gonna miss these breakfasts. Me too. At home it will be back to acai bowls. <laughs> yeah, for you. I'm not a big bre breakfast person, so at home I only drink coffee. 